Today, Donald Trump Jr. took on fake news in a long-awaited speech at AT&T Stadium. He had some pretty sharp criticism for the mainstream media and the agendas of former presidents George W. Bush and Barack Obama. News A's Sebastian Robertson has more on the power lunch in Arlington. His speech wasn't for the news cameras, and there were no tickets available for the public. I thought it was a great speech. I just wanted to hear what he had to say. I'm an alum of the University of North Texas. This was a private event, and tickets didn't come cheap. University officials say a sponsor donated $100,000 to cover the speaking fee. Then another $125,000 was raised to cover the rental fee at AT&T Stadium. I think it was an interesting choice for UNT just because um, it seems UNT's image perhaps doesn't fully align with having him speak. Sarah Sarder, a UNT student, snapped these pictures during the speech. She was one of a few current students among the crowd of more than 600 guests. They represented business owners, school supporters, and alumni. This despite a petition signed by nearly 90 UNT faculty members opposing the visit altogether. It was pretty outstanding. A great message. Talked about great values of our country and what, what, what the meaning of, a, of a being American is. And I thought that was pretty extraordinary. He uh, spoke very forthrightly, uh, uh, no holes barred and had a great message. That message may very well be heard again tomorrow, as Trump Jr. was, in a way, just the opening act. That's because President Trump is expected in North Texas tomorrow afternoon. He'll be hosting a private fundraiser in Dallas. In Arlington, Sebastian Robertson, Channel 8 News.